Hey boys, what is up? Welcome back to some more Sean Johnson career mode. And last video we left off, uh, left off. We uh, we lost to the Broncos in the the first round of the finals in the Auckland Nines. So we uh, we I just I didn't play the preseason games. I just simulated them. So we're taking on the Knights in round one of the regular season. As we look at both sides, they're obviously standard 2015. Lineups, well, not really standard. They are they're a little different uh, than probably the 2015 real life teams, but pretty much the same squad. So the 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 Warriors, uh, you know, uh, compared to their 2016 squad, it's uh it's not very good. But overall, I think it's a pretty decent side. And you know, I'm expecting. I don't know if we're gonna win. I don't know if we're gonna win the grand final this season, but. We'll, we'll at least make the top eight. I'm pretty confident of that. And we're going to start the game off pretty strongly here. Uh, good first set. Well, yeah, good start to the game. And we get tackled on last play there. But a beautiful little kick back on the inside there. I actually don't know who, who that is. Is that Lululuwai? I think it is. Young Thomas puts in a beautiful crossfield grubber right there. And Sammy Tompkins picks up the first try of the game. So, you know, we got tackled on last play. And I thought I sort of squandered... A uh, bit of an opportunity to put in an attacking kick, but our halves partner definitely made good work of that one right there. And yeah, nice little play right there, just taking you to the line. We get whacked as well, but you know that's what we got to do as a half. As a half, you're going to get hit a few times. And the Knights here, bit of field position, a bit of attacking play, and the <laughs> result in putting up two bombs in the same same little play. The second kick was actually god awful, and it would have been nice if we could uh could have played on from that uh, kick, but unfortunately. That's not how the game works. Take a catching goal, obviously, 20 meter tap. But yeah, just, uh, you know, just got to get used to playing as a halfback. It's more about setting up other players, even though Johnson, he's, uh, he's, you know, he's a bit of a running halfback. Obviously, he does a lot of try assists as well, but he's one of those guys that definitely sets up their plays. But right here, we put up a bit of a speculative bomb, and we're going to get the bat back, and we were almost there to pick, to swoop on that ball and race around. That was actually almost, it almost worked out. That would have been pretty nice. But off the kickoff here, almost straight through. Might be Dane Gagai coming across there to make a pretty important tackle. Or otherwise we were through. And right there, just using the numbers, we had to get it out. But unfortunately, couldn't set up the winger there. 74 meters gain though. This is a pretty decent set. Uh, last tackle though. And that is a beautiful kick. It hits the post as well. And a nice kick chase. Couldn't pin them in the end goal, but, you know, you'll take that any day of the week. So, 32 minutes gone in the Knights. A uh, bit bit nervous, I guess. A bit uh, flustered. And what play that is. Johnson straight through. Gets the offload. Well, I doesn't get the offload. Gets the pass away. But for some reason, I think it's Fusatua on the wing there. He, uh, I don't know. He just threw the ball to the Knights. So, that was a beautiful play by us. We just straight through the gap. Set up our winger. He should have just gone over for a try. But for some reason, he, he just... Uh, had no room, and then what, I don't even know what happens there, the Knights two like offloaded the ball straight to us, and for s somehow the, the ball ended up on the wing to the Knights player, so that was all very confusion, uh, confusing, and they were down the sideline, but thankfully we were actually back there, because um, we were already running back, so they didn't, uh, they didn't race away to score, but right here, uh, poor offload by our boys, but there's only like one play left in the game, all we have to do is hold them out, and uh, they are going to give up the ball again, and we get the offload away, but that is going forward. So, a 6-0 first half lead. You know, we'll take that. Not too not too shabby. And from the kicks, you know, we're trying to trying to help out Tompkins get back there for a bit of support. But that time, does not work out in our favor. We palm off the first dude, but go straight over the sideline. So, not great stuff. And we were finding the trouble to get out of our set, uh, get out of our half this, this second half. So, put in a nice long kick there using Johnson's good kicking ability in this game and have a bit of a win, a bit of win behind us. So we uh, we should probably take a bit of advantage of that. And right here we set up big uh, big Vatavai looks like out on the wing. Almost straight through, but the fullback comes across. And then right here, 53 minutes gone, last play, 40 meters out. We decided to go for a bit of a field goal, but we do end up missing. It might come back to bite us, but... Yeah, it was. Uh, I think it was worth an effort. You know, a lot of time left, but it's always good to get that seven-point lead or just uh, more than a converted try lead, especially especially on like a harder difficulty because uh, the AI can definitely score from anywhere. 
And they're going to do just that. As It's going to be Kurt Gidley who's actually playing fullback. I forgot who their fullback was, but Vatavai probably should have caught up to him, but for some reason cut back. Uh, but right here, he just went straight through the middle, and as soon as he palmed off Tompkins, he just got like this massive burst of speed. And we were gaining on him, but uh, he just had the legs. Put in a valiant effort. Came from a, we came from a fair way away to put in that effort, but yeah, uh, like I was saying, it could come from anywhere, and that's exactly what happened. The Knights on the board, even though we've been pretty dominant this game, so it was quite frustrating to con concede a try like that because the, the Warriors actually defended pretty well this whole game. But right here, we're pretty much going to do what they did to us just before. Sean Johnson on the back of a, I think it was last tackle kick, and I wasn't actually calling for the ball, but then, uh, yeah, they did kick the ball, and it just it just panned out. The whole team sort of covered back, and it just sort of went through the hands. Eventually, it ended up, ended up with ourselves, Johnson, and we uh, beat a couple of players. Kirk Gidley gets shrugged off. He gets a bit of his own medicine right there, and there was no stopping us from there. So, all of a sudden, 12-6 up. How much time left? 10 minutes or so? 8 minutes left as we cut it back here, and Nice little play too. Oh, almost straight through the gap. We just didn't have the momentum. Otherwise, could have been away. And then right here, what the hell? Nathan Friend throws a ridiculous pass. And we are going to get, like, lose like 20 meters. We get tackled on last play. So it's not going to be us kicking. And, oh my god. <laughs> Big Matterby kicks a fucking ball almost backwards. And the Knights are going to come up with it. <laughs> oh my god. I can't, that is hilarious. I can't believe that shit, dude. <laughs> Vatavai, what was that? He literally kicked it directly sideways. I just, I don't even know. But great defense there. I think Sam Tompkins comes up with a big hit. Once again, one-on-one. -on -one. Centimeters away from the line. And then right here, it was probably our fault, honestly. Chris Housen is going to score. Um, even if we, you know, I say it's our fault because <clears throat> we sort of didn't read it. I thought he was going to go across the face, but... Probably if we made contact, Housen probably still would have barred his way over. I mean, it was still ridiculous from that bloody Nathan Friend pass that set it all up. And then, uh, big Vatavai, I mean, you know, he put in the F. <laughs> he shouldn't have been there. Oh, and then right here, oh my god, no time left. I call for the fucking pass. They don't give it to me. I was going to go for a field goal. I was furious. And then I get, they put me to dummy half, so I can't go for a field goal again. I was furious, dude. Oh my god, I'm just running around trying to set up something. I can't do anything. I was so mad at that point, honestly, because there were two opportunities that just got blown. I'm pretty sure I would have had the distance because we had a bit of wind behind us as well. Oh, but what a pass out that offload. Johnson. Johnson magic. We set up a bit of a attacking play, but they turned the ball over. 82 minutes into, or two minutes into the overtime, and they're just going to pot a field goal. We try to get up, put a bit of pressure on, but Tom Avave there, Carlos slots it and we lose a game we should have won honestly I think we were the better side but look at those completions both sides were awful but that's just how it goes unfortunately um hopefully you guys enjoyed hopefully we can turn our season around but see you guys the next time